Installing a traffic signal at a dangerous intersection may seem like an obvious safety improvement, but in Oregon, signalized and stop-controlled intersections account for nearly 400 deaths and serious injuries each year. Nationwide, these intersections account for roughly 25% of all traffic fatalities. Oregon intersection crash severity data reveals that installing a traffic signal at these types of intersections does not increase safety but instead leads to increases in serious injury crashes. It's critical that safer designs are implemented, especially at high-risk intersections. Roundabouts have proven to be a safer and more efficient type of intersection. The Federal Highway Administration Office of Safety identified modern roundabout intersections as a proven life-saving roadway safety strategy and is encouraging all states to install them. More significantly, Roundabouts reduce the types of crashes where people are seriously hurt or killed by 78 to 82 percent compared to conventional stop-controlled and signalized intersections. Because of ODOT's commitment to improving safety on Oregon roadways, we're working with local communities to install more roundabouts at high-risk intersections. When we teamed up with ODOT on Highway 47 at Verbort, that was one where clearly Highway 47 had a lot of traffic and we had stopped on the side and, and the roundabout worked out very well. We worked with ODOT and we worked with the, the trucking industry to make sure that that design was good for them. It is a great benefit to the citizens and safety-wise, they're just so much safer than a signalized intersection on a high-speed road. So the roundabouts we designed today are much better than what they were in years past. The first roundabouts we constructed in the 1990s were kind of a first generation design. Today's modern roundabouts are much better for all modes of users. They are much safer, better operations. We've learned a lot from years past. Modern roundabouts also have updated improvements like accessibility for people with disabilities, pedestrians, and bicycles. Clackamas County's had really good success with roundabouts as a form of intersection traffic control that allows us to address both safety and capacity issues. One of the features that's really helpful with them is the way they're designed, people slow down before they enter the roundabout. And then in addition, once they get in the roundabout, everybody's traveling in the same direction. So left turn crashes, angle type crashes are eliminated. Operation is improved by smooth flowing traffic. There's no waiting at a signalized intersection for the light to turn green when no other traffic is around. A roundabout handles as much or more volume than a signal will handle in the right situation, and a roundabout is much more efficient than a stop-controlled intersection. To accommodate the freight traffic traveling US-20 near Sisters, ODOT performed a simulation of a roundabout to make sure the design works for all types of large trucks, including oversized loads. When we're designing a roundabout, um, we meet with the freight industry to determine what trucks need to get through that roundabout. And in that negotiation, we discuss the dimensions. They give us dimensions for their fleet vehicles that need to get through, and then we create custom templates to simulate what that truck will do. There are many benefits of roundabouts. Increased safety, nearly 100% reduction in fatal and serious injury crashes, improved traffic flow, including large freight, reduced emissions, and lower maintenance costs. The Oregon Department of Transportation is committed to improving safety on all Oregon roadways and works to provide a safe, efficient transportation system that supports economic opportunity and livable communities for all Oregonians.